Hey everyone, it's Firefighter Ryan, and I'm Firefighter Emilio, and today we're going to teach you about the Friendly Monster. Today Emilio is going to get dressed up in his all bunker gear, which is going to protect him from the fire. Now, you're going to see him if you're in a house fire, but don't be scared of him. He may look scary, but he's really just Emilio. So today we're going to show you what it's like when he gets bunked up. So what are you going to do first, Emilio? First, I put on this hood, just like this. And that hood right there is going to protect his neck and his ears from fire. So what are you going to do next, Emilio? Now, I already have my pants on. So now when I have my pants and my boots on, <clears throat> next, I put on my coat. And that coat's going to protect his whole upper body from any fire that's coming towards him. Now, if you touch this, you're going to know that it's real rough. And that's only to protect it from the fire and the smoke. Now, he may look a little bit bigger and different now that he has his coat on, but it's still just Emilio in there. So now that I got my jacket on, the next thing, this is where it gets a little bit scarier. I'm gonna go ahead and put on my hood, or my mask, I should say. Now this mask right here is gonna protect his whole face from any kind of smoke and fire that can get to him. It's also going to hook up to his air pack, which is right here, which you'll see in a minute. Now, once I get this on, I'm going to go ahead and pull my hood over. Now, when he pulls the hood over the mask, it's going to seal off any kind of exposure on his face so no smoke can get inside of his hair and no fire can catch his hair on fire. So, he's going to be fully protected in his head now. Next. Now Emilio's gonna hook onto his air pack, which is the scary part. This air pack right here is gonna be what's giving him air and letting him survive inside of the hazardous condition, such as fire and smoke inside of a house. Now it may look like he has some weird kind of machine on his back, but it's really just the air pack, so it's nothing to be scared of. Nothing's gonna hurt you on here. Now, when you're gonna hear me, you didn't hear this. Now, I put my helmet on. Next. Now this helmet's gonna protect him. If anything in the house falls on top of his head, it's not gonna actually hit his head. It's gonna hit the top of his helmet. And that face shield is also gonna help protect his face along with his mask. Now what's next, Emilio? Next, I put on my gloves. Now these gloves are gonna protect his hands from any kind of fire. Now we're going to show you what it's like when he's hooked on air. It's not anything to be scared of, it's just what he needs to survive inside of the atmosphere. Now if you want to come and get a little bit closer so you can hear him. That's just him breathing. Nothing to be scared of, it's still just Emilio inside of there. Why don't you wake him up? He's not there to hurt you, he's there to help you out. All right, so let's go ahead and go off there. Now let's show him what it's gonna look like when you're crawling towards him. Now, since there's smoke and fire inside the house, Emilio can't stand up because the smoke is up here. He needs to stay under the smoke level and stay where it's nice and cool. So if you see Emilio in there, he's gonna be crawling around like this searching for you. Don't hide from him, he's gonna need you to come out so he can make his job easier. Alright, now Emilio's gonna take off all his equipment and show you that it's just him under there. First, he's gonna be taking off his gloves. Next is his helmet. Now he's gonna be taking off his hood. And now his mask. See? It's just Emilio under there. We're not here to hurt you, we're here to help you. 